Hey folks, Big Dino here again. This time with a look at one of the new um, Pokemon card game Fates Collide Summer Tins. Um, yeah, the Pokemon company, whenever they come out with a new sort of card set, they always bring out two or three of these tins um, with promo EXs in them and four sets of cards. Um, this one is everyone's favourite um, <laughs> amalgamation of Dragon Ball Z's Cell mixed with Power Rangers Megazord sort of thing. <laughs> um, yeah, Zygarde is essentially a Pokemon who has forms instead of evolutions. Um, and essentially, cells come together to create different versions of Zygarde. It's all a bit confusing. It's still ongoing in the show, I believe, but we don't really know much of this guy. Apart from the fact everyone was expecting him to have his own game. And he didn't. They sort of bypassed him. <laughs> I don't know if he's going to play more of a role in Sun and Moon, but we'll get into that at another time. Um, so yeah, I'm going to take this away quickly and unpack it. And done. <laughs> I love jump cuts. <laughs> yeah, so um, we'll keep them there for a wee second because I also want to show you a couple cards I got either without recording or actually purchased. Um, these two I got from America, quite cheap. Lugia, for those of you who don't know, is probably my favourite Pokemon out of, well, all of them. So... When I realised there was a set out just before I started collecting that had Lugia in it, I just had to buy them. I <laughs> really had. Um, these two were £10, which seems a bit expensive, but let's be honest. You can get a lot worse. And there we go. These are my little <laughs> phone stand things that I bought. Just to show off cards and things. And I also got this out of a Generations pack. Pikachu. One of the ones I was actually looking for. Um, unfortunately I didn't show it getting unboxed. Because I wasn't actually expecting to get another one. Um, but yeah. Let's see if I can... There we go. I have one more. Just in case we get a special one out of this pack. But, let's open it. So, the tins come off like that. You get one... One promo card. Um, it's basically a different picture of one that you get in the actual set. Um, but yeah, one of the only EX cards, apart from Lucario, I think, that has three attacks. And higher than average HP for an EX, so definitely a playable card, apart from his retreat cost, but you can get around that. Um, so yeah, let's slide him out of that, and pop him on with Pikachu, there we go. So you get a code card in the actual tin, which unlike normal, you get a 60 card deck with this code card, um, containing two Zygarde EXs, which is quite good. Um, it's quite handy and makes these worthwhile, at least for the purposes of playing online. And you also get four packs of cards. Um, there we go, pop that back there. And yeah, so what do we have? We have two Fates Collide, one of which is my favourite Lugia, and the other one is Zygarde, fittingly. And we get a Breakthrough Pack, um, which is the Mewtwo-centric one, and we also get Rolling Skies. I wasn't expecting that. Rolling Skies is quite sought after because of, as far as I know, it includes the Versus Seeker card and also Shaman EX. 
which works for a variety of decks. So we'll leave that one till last. Let's go with the Breakthrough Pack, first of all. There we go. Will we see that? Oh, we won't. And one, two, three. So, we have Magneton, Giovanni's Scheme, Kelea, Pikachu, Hoot Hoot, Remoraid, Teddy Ursa, Scatterbug, Reverse is a Hoot Hoot, and a regular rare Star Raptor. Fortunately, we didn't get any Mewtwo EXs. Um, let's go on to Zygarde. Oh, you can see the code on that one. Can't let you see the code. <laughs> um, ah, this one's a different kind, so that usually means there's a hollow or better in it. One, two, three. Let's see. So we have N, Dugong, Wigglytuff, Gothita, Fennekin, Seal, Burmy, Larvitar, Reverse Fossil Excavation Kit, and, oh, an Aerodactyl. Okay, so maybe that's not a guarantee? I honestly have no idea anymore. <laughs> I was expecting something in that pack there. Um, let's see. Hopefully it's something. Oh, that code is... One, two, three. So we have Alakazam, Spirit Link, Fossil Excavation Kit, Wormadam, Bronzor again, Deerling, Carbink, the bane of many a deck, Fennekin, Seal, Reverse, or Madame, and a Lucario non holo. Ha! Huh. So it's all down to the rare pack to actually get us something. <laughs> Here's hoping. There we go. So, there we go. Let's see that. One, two, three. And we have Trainer's Mail, Fletchender, Wide Lens, Wingull, Inke, Togepi, Execute, Natu, Reverse is a Double Dragon Energy, and a regular wear Scarmony. Hmm. Well, guys, um, unfortunately, that was kind of a letdown. Kind of glad I showed you the cards that I bought myself now, <laughs> um, as opposed to all these, so yeah, let's go through and see what we actually got, shall we, there we go, that says, so, of the four, we didn't get any reverse holo rares, and we got four regular rares. That's a bit of a letdown. But hey, the Zygarde EX plus the code card kind of makes up for it. Just ever so slightly. Plus you've got a useful tin. So, yeah guys, until next time, I'll see y'all later.